How difficult or easy is it to play in Pep's system, Pep Guardiola's system? That's a good question, to be honest. Um, I mean, it, it's it's not easy. It's always tough because uh, obviously Pep has, uh, yeah, standards and he has expectations uh, for for each player, not just the the midfielders, also strikers, defenders, goalkeepers. So he has a plan, like 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 all the other uh, managers as well. But um, I think um, the way he's thinking about the game, all the details he includes into his tactics. Um, yeah, makes it quite tough and challenging for for every individual, you know, um, to yeah get into the system, you know, and uh, of course also yeah um, to show his own uh, individual uh, creativity as well. But um, I do see it as a challenge, and uh, a challenge is for me always something positive. Um, and I think I did quite well over the last years. And even though I still think I can personally also improve, and I can put even even more into the team than I, than I had, um, than I did. Um, so um, I take every training session serious and I, I want to perform in every training session. I think um, that's how you become um, one of the top players as well. Um, and uh, I have also standards for myself. So that's why um, I don't want to, I don't want to fail a pass in, in, in the training session um, as I don't want it obviously in the game as well. Uh, I don't want to miss balls in trainings. And so I think, if you focus on these kind of stuff already in, in training sessions, um, it's just good for the, for the games. What's the biggest, uh, the biggest thing you have learned from Pep what, that has made you a different player? What's, what's the one thing you can name that he has taught you, that you learned from him, that has improved your game? I think the biggest thing I've learned is um, yeah, to visualize the, the, the spaces um, on the field, um, where you where you kind of get um, one player more, you know, you can you can you can see the space where you where you have to put the ball, the pass. You know, I try to see the game more as as as, as one. You know, every single every single um, yeah corner of the of the field. Um, I try to always uh, be ready and uh, be focused for every single situation. Um, where do my op opponent want to attack me? You know. Um, which, which way can I turn? Um, where is my teammate uh, free? So um, I think, especially when I play, uh, when I play as a holding midfielder, um, you know, I get, to, I get to touch the ball a lot. And obviously, um, you, you have to cre create in that position. So um, whether it's a two-on-one two or um, a ball through, through, through the defense, so... Um, See the, see the whole game as, as, as one whole thing, you know? And um, I think that's something that I haven't done like that before. Um, and uh, that's mainly because of Pep's, Pep's input. Okay, the other day uh, we were interviewing uh, Leganes uh, coach Javier Aguirre, and he was talking about Pep's Barcelona, that infamous Barcelona team, that very good Barcelona team. And he said, the thing about his system is, the work rate you had to put in to win the ball. They were better defensively, which created these offensive opportunities. For you, being that two-way player, is it more difficult for you playing with Pep, the defensive work rate or offensive? For me personally, it's, 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 it's offensive. Uh, offensive is more challenging, more difficult. I mean, um, maybe also because of, I don't know, 90, 95% of all the games, um, we have more possession, we have more passes, we control the game. Um, so obviously our opponents, they wait for us, you know, um, to do something, to create something. Um, of course, the defense plays also its part and uh, I don't want to deny it and it's also important. Um, but um, we also focus about the game with the ball, to be honest. And um, that's not always easy because sometimes you have opponents who defend very well, to be honest. Um, but I, I, I feel like for Pep, that's always, that's what he wants as well. You know, he wants an opponent that defends well because he doesn't want to do every game, every single game, the same system, the same formation, same players, um, because that's not really how you get successful because sometimes you have to adapt. Um, and, um, that's the challenge. I think that also Pep sees, um, for his, uh, his teams always, um, to do also sometimes stuff that surprises a little bit also in, in, in the tactics and uh, of course also in selecting the players 
Um, but yeah, mainly it works out. I think uh, his success speaks for itself. And uh, that's why we are all happy to have him. Thanks so much for watching ESPN on YouTube. And for more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for premium content and live streaming, subscribe to ESPN+.